Morning, and welcome back to the vlogs. It's a new day, so I'm doing a new FTP test. Is that right? FTP or FPT? Yeah, I'm doing a, a, a power test on a Watt bike at Lee Valley Athletics in a 20 minute intense session. Before I go, I've got to sharpen up. I want to look good for this. This needs to go. Let the massacre begin. I haven't charged my clippers enough. Mine's actually hurt. My head. It's amazing how a, a good haircut, <laughs> not that mine's a good haircut, <laughs> but it saves me 15, it's 15, 15 pounds for a male haircut in a barber's, in a black barber's. Which, I think it's a lot of money. I know women pay a lot more, but 15 pounds. Can you hear that? It's dying. Didn't charge it up night before. Oh, what a day. Should we take it right to the last moment? I know you're thinking you're dragging this video out and you should just get on with your FTP test. But this is really, to me, this is great fun. I love making these videos and moments like this really amuse me. Wonder how long it'll last. 10 seconds? I reckon I can go for another minute. Still hanging in there. But all is not lost because we return to the traditional blade. We get the job done. Final last words. Not even words, just utterings. Die! Why don't you just die and be done so I can recharge you? Yes. It's dead. Oh, that's quite sad now. We're done. Let's do that again. The reveal. Let's do the reveal. bad eh not bad not bad save myself 15 pounds let's hit that gym we have arrived let's do it socks on the back seat not a cool look so an FTP test Functional threshold power. How much power can you hold on the watt bike for one hour? But how the test works, it tests you over 20 minutes. Here she is, the love of my life. This is what happens, yeah. Pre workout, pre workout from the man, from the man, the main man. Brian, my buddy, my island. Yeah, yeah, real deal. Now it's all very well having giraffe legs, <laughs> but there are times when having normal legs, whatever that looks like, is a good idea. Like now, trying to use this Watt bike and the seat post isn't quite high enough. So we swap it out. We also a deeper padded seat to give us a bit more height and it kind of works, but then we have to wedge a piece of cardboard into the back of the seat post to keep it in place. And then we're off. Somebody pass me a towel. You might have noticed by all the grimacing on my face that it's starting to hurt. If there was ever a time I wanted to stop, it was now. I wasn't over at this point and Brian's egging me on from the corner like come on keep it going keep going right to the end so I had to keep it going if 
Thanks, Brian. we got onto the 20 minute in fact we did the 10 minute warm-up first which was um, nice F T P T. I'm home and I'm and I'm looking at the stats and I'm impressed to be honest when I finished the session I thought that wasn't that hot that wasn't that as powerful as I thought it was I thought I'd be able to hold a lot more but now looking at the numbers I did okay. Your boy did okay. 20 minutes distance, 8.3 mi 8 miles. Average power for me was 284 watts. Bearing in mind on Zwift, my average is normally 180, 190 watts. Uh, my average cadence was 95 revolutions per minute, which I'm pleased with. My average power to kilogram weight was 2.84 watts to kilogram, which is really, really good because on Zwift it's down at like 1.8 1.9 so really pleased average speed 25.89 miles per hour peak power in that session 709 watts well impressed with that peak speed 36.71 miles per hour and the good news is i know hold on a minute just touch the screen i know i can do a lot more so i'm really happy with that thank you what bike for that brilliant session at the lee valley session Big, thank, big shout out to Brian at Lee Valley Athletics who helped me set up my app and for, just helped me out, really helped me out, tell me all about the Watt bike, how to set it up, how to set the seat up, the right height, how to set my handlebars up. In fact, the interesting point, interesting point, the seat wasn't high enough. What we need is an extension seat post. So if anyone from Better is watching my video, which I doubt you are, but anyone from Better who run Lee Valley Athletics we need an extension seat post because I'm six foot five. So I'm, my legs are not quite getting a full extension. I'm not getting a full power. So I reckon with my extended seat post, I can get up over 330 watts average. That's what I reckon. Keep watching the videos. Don't forget to like it and um, challenge yourself to do more. Have a great day.